All right, uh, let's look at the homework 4.6, problem number three. All right, it says that the deli sells uh, 720 sandwiches per day at the price of uh, $6 each. And it says that uh, for every uh, 0 point, so 10 cent reduction in price, 40 more sandwiches will be sold. How much should the deli charge in order to maximize revenue? All right, so let's do that. All right, so uh, we want to maximize revenue. So uh, let's see. Let's uh, let's let um, x be the number of uh, ten cent uh, reductions. All right. So revenue is always um, so revenue. Uh, I guess a function of x is going to be a, a price. So we have to know the price it's selling. Uh, so this is going to be the price and times the number of uh, sandwiches. All right. All right. Price. So let's say we did uh, x uh, x uh, ten cents reductions. All right. So which means that uh, originally uh, base price is six, and you're subtracting a ten cent times x. So that would be the expression for the price, and the number for each reduction you can you can sell forty more. Which means that uh, at the a base price you can sell 720, but uh, since we did x reductions, we can sell 40 times x more sandwiches, right? So that will be the function, right? So let's find the um, um, you know critical number by taking a derivative. So take the derivative of this guy. You get uh, so product rule the multiplication derivative of that is negative 0.1. And times the second, 720 uh, plus 40x plus first guy, which is 6 minus 0.1x times the derivative of the second, so that would be 40, right? So that's going to be, uh, let's see, distribute uh, negative 72 minus 4x, right, plus. And 480, so 40 times 6. Uh, uh, actually, yeah, I messed it up. Actually, I can't do the multiplication. 4 times 6 is uh, 24, and with a 0, right? 40 times that is a negative 4x, right? So it seems like we're going to get, uh, let's see, negative 8x. Right, uh, plus uh, 100, uh, let's see, uh, 62, uh, 68, is that right? So 240 minus 2, uh, let's see, 3 minus 7, 60, so yeah, looks like it. Right, set that equal to 0. Right, so we have, uh, let's see, negative 8x, so I'm going to subtract the 168. So uh, is equal to negative 168. And then we can just uh, divide through by negative 8. So x is going to be, all right, so what's this? So negative, negative cancel out. So 2, 8 is into 16, so 21. All right, so we're going to do uh, 21 10 cent reductions, all right? So which means that the price, uh, so we want the price P which is 6 minus right 0 0.1 times 21 so which means that the 6 minus 2.1 that will give us uh, 3.9 right so which means that uh, it's a three dollars and a ninety cents is the best price so let's type it in All right so go here uh, 390 all right, check the answer. All right, we got that. 
All right, so part D is just a, uh, the same problem with the different numbers, so I'll let you guys finish it, but uh, I'm, I'm pretty sure you can, uh, you know, you can handle part B. All right, that's it. I hope that uh, this was clear.